What's up guys? Hello, welcome to another career mode with Dortmund. I'm not keeping track and I should, but wait, this is 14, number 14, that's right. Um, as you can probably see, I am severely tired. Like, I am running on 8 hours of sleep in just 2 days. You know, something you might be used to or uh, have to deal with it uh, work-wise or anything like that, but it sucks. So we got an email, looks like. Important transfer market information. Transfer market is now open. Remember that player's value will vary based on their form. Okay, blah, blah, blah. They're just kind of giving me... Oh, and we got a player conversation. Never mind. Thanks, boss. Oh, yeah, I already looked at that, though. But you're welcome. You deserve it, like I said last time. Okay, so you guys know what the team looks like. It is very advanced and sexy. All that good stuff. Popping, locking, dropping. Looking like a flopping. And... Oh, God, wait. January. Oh... So we're not going to be playing for a while. So I guess that's okay. I'm going to do these player developments. Get those out of the way real quick. Okay, I'll do these real quick, as usual. So I'll be back in like 30 seconds. There you guys have it. That is the training. There's only one D that happened uh, with Zagadu. And then A, B, A, C. So that's a very good training. That is amazing. Player of the year was Hazard. Did, wait, did he win again or is it the same thing? Eh, whatever. Well, actually, I'm interested. I'll look when this simulation stops. Look at him. He's so happy. Oh, you. You, you, you. Manager of the year is Conte. Leverkusen's turn over Kelly Hohn. What? I didn't even know Leverkusen got Kelly Hohn. That's a good signing. We're going against Wolfsburg. We have three emails, so we're going to look at those real quick, and then we'll hop into the game right away. And I'm just warning you, this might be a short episode. I'm not sure. It's just because I'm so tired that... It's just, I don't think I could stay up for a whole hour. Another, another hour, like, I feel like I'm just going to pass out. So, I'll tr I will try my best to do three games. But if I don't, I apologize. But at least you'll still get two good games that are hopefully just good for the episode. So, let's look. Oh, yeah, the updates. Yeah, for monthly scouts. I forgot about that. Attached to the scouting report. This month's plea review. Okay, cool. All right, let's see these real quick. Ethan Lewis, Cameron Richardson, Archie Carter, Dylan Watson. That's, wow. George Green. Okay. English, 6'2", left foot. That doesn't look too good. Oh! These two look good. Um, I'm going to go with this guy. Cameron Richardson. Age 15. Sign player. And, you know, I'll get him too. RG Carter. I'll get him too. These guys are kind of... Eh, sweet. Alright, let's check these guys out. Oh my god. That's another good one. Patrice... Oh, he's French. That's why. Patrice Alphen. We'll sign him up. And then another scout. We'll see that real quick. That's okay. That's pretty good, too. Telmo Yurado. Uh, Juan Hernandez. I might take him. David Ibi Ibanez. Ibanez? Yeah. I'll take these two. Because those are they're pretty decent. He just doesn't have a lot of mentality. Which is, I guess, that's fine. I'll take him. Alright, we signed a lot of young players so I'm gonna have to really train those guys too because I don't want to leave them on the bench just sitting there not getting any playtime or anything all right guys we're gonna start this next game against Wolfsburg and hopefully keep up the lead like always in the Bundesliga if we lose we lose but let's get it on guys Bundesliga match day something I didn't get to read it we're only against Wolfsburg and we are ready to fight, fight, fight for our rights to party. Bro. Bro, what are you doing? That's just racist. It's because he's Italian, isn't it? Oh, Philip. Philip, Philip, Philip. Yes! Insane, I actually want a header. That's the funny thing. That's what makes me want to just cry happiness. 
because he literally just won a header. Look, one nil, guys. A boom, a yang. We can do this. Oh my Jesus, dude. That would have been a banger. Raymond, come on, man. Interpost is so stupid. Oh, man. Come on. Oh. Oh, yes. Obama getting what he threw ball. Philip. Dude, Philip is so good. Oh my god, I'm gonna keep saying that because he just he, he proves me wrong, proves me wrong every time. Like I feel like oh he might miss that, but he just bangs it in, man. He hits the nut and cracks the nutcracker. You know what I'm saying? God, Christmas is coming, bro, bro, bro. You gotta chill. I know you have UPS in your arm. It doesn't give you the right to tackle me that hard, you know what I'm saying? Come on. Come on. If I can make this free kick, I want to be jolly. I'm going to use a bomb yank too. Screw it. Here we go. Here we go. Nope. 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 It's halftime, guys. Welcome to the halftime show where I'm going to show you the best moves of the year. All right, here we go. You ready for this? Look at this. See my controller? Outstanding. So we're 2-1 up, guys, into the second half. Let's get her done. Oh, my God. Is, do you guys see this? You see how Interpost is just so OP? It almost beat me again. But we're on this amazing run. I don't know what to do. How about this? Oh, man. I thought that was the right thing to do. About, I should have given it to a bomb yank, but he's so cute. Oh, my God. Insigne. He's killing it. Oh, my God. Insigne. Insigne. Philip! Oh, no! Oh, my God. Insigne was ripping through the defense, just toying with them, just playing with them like they're little kids. That didn't sound right. I'm I'm gonna not whatever. Yeah, what? No, oh, Raymond. Thank you, thank you, Raymond. I am not playing to my best right now. You know, it's being sleepy is one thing, but playing, but being sleepy and playing FIFA, that's just terrible. Well, there you go, guys. The first game wasn't really eventful. Um, like I said, I'm playing pretty bad right now. Like, it's just not working too well being so sleepy. But I somehow got a 2-1 win. So we are back with the gap in the table. Still, we're keeping it uh, pretty high at the moment. We got lucky. Wolfsburg actually played pretty well. Like, I was surprised. I thought we were going to have a pretty simple game. But, like, they were creating some chances. And they were defending, like, wildebeests. And, like always, we're going to do these player developments. And then we will jump right into the next game. Well, guys, this is the training of the day. And what the heck? Like, it's like C, C, D, C, C. I don't know why. But we're actually trying to get Richardson a little bit of training. Because um, he's the only one, actually, that can get trained. And just progress with his overall. Uh, which is weird. So, that's why I put him in there, and then, of course, Zagato and Sancho, because, you know, those are the main guys trying to get up. Which reminds me, when you play Sancho? But we're in advance, and then we'll go right and do the next game. Hold the phone real quick. Rafael Guerrero has been offered a contract from Atletico Madrid. 28 million euros. Um... I don't know. Like, the sad thing is, I don't really see myself using Guerrero, even though, like, he's really good. Um, and I love Guerrero. But, it's just, the midfield we have, like, it's just, he doesn't really fit in there. Unless I 
took Philip out and played Raphael in there and changed the formation a little bit. And then put Philip as just like the substitute for a bombing, you know? Uh, I might try that. So if that doesn't work out, you know, then whatever. So I'll just click this, show action. Um, actually, I'm just going to ignore it. Okay. And then Weidenfeller transfer approach made. Hanover. Okay, that's fine. If he wants to go to Hanover, that's 100% fine. All right, so I'm going to do that real quick with the squad. Uh, change the formation up to a 4-3-3 holding with cast some... No. There we go. And then Guerrero will play right here. Ooh, that does look really good. Not gonna lie. Yeah, that looks really good. Okay. We'll do that. And then we will progress in the calendar. Hopefully. Gee, how long do these games go? I thought we were... Why, why did I say we're going to get... Did I say we're going to get Stuttgart? If I did, I don't know what was in my head. But we're going to get Hertha Berlin. Weidenfeller's leaving. Okay, that's fine. A legend is leaving, I have to say. And it's good that he's leaving. But you know what? Legend. Oh, look at that. Berkey's offered. Oh, wait. This could be it. Remember when I said we wanted a new goalkeeper? I love Berkey. But in this game, he's made some very bad choices with me. His decision making and everything has been pretty bad. Uh, he's made some good saves, but nothing that can really define him as world class. I'd say he's a good goalkeeper, but he's not like world class. So if I sell him with the money I have, I could possibly get someone else. I might go for Timo Horn. Farman. No, I don't want to get Farman. That's actually a good question. I want to hold off on that. Meh. Actually, you know what? I will sell him. I'll sell him, get the money, and then I'll. I'm gonna ask you guys who you think I should get as goalkeeper because we're only gonna have. If I sell him for about 30 million, we have 27, so it's only gonna be about 57 million, almost 60 million. And I mean, that can give us a, go a decent goalkeeper, but not like a really, really good one. Like we can't get De Gea. That's out of the question. He's he's a lot. So let me know what you guys think of who we should get. But if um, if there isn't really an answer at all, um, then I might just have to go with my gut and go with someone I think will be okay. But I wanted to see what you guys think because I want you guys to get into this. So please let me know. So I'll sell him. I will kind of... Um, yeah, no, wait. Yeah, I'll put him for 30 million. Accept offer. Okay. There we go. And now we go on to the game. Hey guys, I got an email from the Hood saying he wants to play a game. So I'm going to let him. Uh, I'll wait for the Guerrero uh, Weigel Casimiro combination for another game. But the good thing is we have Castro back. So we actually do have some more depth now. But the thing is, we already have enough because Guerrero. To, and who can take in these any of these spots in the middle that quick so Castro can just sit on the bench and rots I'm just kidding just sit there and watch please let's get into the game all right guys match day 19 against Hertha Berlin we are at the Olympia Stadium I believe it's called I think but it's where the DFP Pokal final is always played. And where some of the uh, World Cup games are played. Um, qualifiers and stuff. So Let's get it. Dong diggity. Oh my god. They hit the post. Oh god. Oh my god. Oh Jesus. Insignia. Yes! Yes! Oh my god, what a cross with Pereira. And Cena was wide open. Wide open. He was just like, bruh. I see it loud and clear. 
There's the first half, guys. A very boring one, like super boring. Hertha has just been defending this whole time, and I can't do anything. Like, I just, there's just no action going on in this game right now. It's just, oh. So, I'm going to take out Tehud and put in Guerrero and take out Bale for Sancho and Signe put on the right. Let's just try that out. Get some more energy flowing up in this team, you know what I'm saying? Chemistry, you know what I'm saying? We gotta, we gotta build it. Hmm, that's a penalty right there. Oh, man. Cool. I love it. Man. I, I just tap B. I don't even hold it to do that, like, lunge. And that just, that BS happens. Can I save it? Bombing. Yes! Yes! 92nd minute goal. Thank you. 2 0. That is a wrap, ladies and gentlemen. You gotta just wrap that present up, give it to that kid, and say, Happy birthday and Merry Christmas. Because it's time to go to Hollywood. I don't know why I'm looking down. I don't know what I'm looking at. I'm looking at my Xbox. I don't know. I'm tired. And there we go, guys. We win 2 0 against Hearth of Berlin. What a boring game. Oh my god. That was so boring to play. Like, I almost fell asleep playing it. Like, all they did were. It was just defending. Like, that's all they did. And, like, the defense was so stupid. Did Schalke lose? They're not showing it. Man, what are we doing here? You're welcome, Dahoud. I'm glad you feel happy about that. We're not on track. Best in our youth development was an important goal for the club. At this moment, it looks like we're not going to hit it. Oh, my God. No. Youth development is at three. It's at three. Domestic su success is something we need to look at. Brand exposure. Earned $170 million through media earnings. Oh, okay. China leaves three younger than 20 years old with potential greater than the average overall rating of players currently in the same position. Sign one youth player to the senior team in the same season they were scouted. Okay, there's six of them that are eligible to do it, so... Oh, no, I was going to say, I thought we uh, got Berkey. Okay, we're going to do some player development, guys, and then we're going to squeeze in... One more game, possibly. I'm thinking about it. I'll I'll decide after this development if we're gonna do that one game. We'll see. Okay, guys, here are the trainings. Sancho got a D and an F, so probably his worst training ever. And then Zagadu got a D, while Richardson and Zagadu's first training got a B. Surprise, surprise, we're going to do the last game. I didn't want to leave you guys with just two, and plus it would probably be pretty short because of how much I want to edit, because the second game, like, literally nothing happened. So I'm going to give you guys three games, because I'm going to feel bad if I don't. So we're going to go in match day 20 against Freiburg at home. Let's go! A bomb yang! Oh, what a save! What a save! Oh, Jesus. I didn't think I was going to go anywhere, honestly. Wow. Oh, please. <laughs> oh, my God. We sold Berkey. Why? Oh, my God. Raymond just stood there. Are you serious? Raymond. Oh my god. Guerrero! Oh my. What a pass by Weigel. That's the first half, guys. We're already. We're down 1 0. Because Raymond. 
but it's been pretty annoying to say the least like this is just ridiculous how many shots look at that uh, it's just gonna be one of those games I think guys but we gotta power through it fortunately Yes! Oh, bomb yank. What a goal. That was a perfect shot. Perfect. Guerrero won it in their side of the field. I didn't think a bomb was going to make that. But he got it. And it was beautiful. Oh, just look at that. Watch this. Mm. Tasty like buttergum. 1-1, one, one, guys. We have the equalizer. Now let's get this game wait it'll bam oh my god that could have been 2-1 he hit the side of the post how unfortunate how unlucky fruitcakes all around oh we drew against Freiburg definitely should have won that game we had chances well not a lot. Okay, we had a lot. It didn't really feel like it. I've been sitting here kind of dead. But the office, we got a transfer offer for Weidel. What? Leverkusen, 47 million. How about. No. Reject offer. And then what else? Berkey sold for. Okay, we got 25 million. So I want you guys to let me know what we should do with the 52 million we have, okay? I need to know and like I said if you guys don't come up with an idea for a player then I'll of course think about a player we can possibly get to uh, replace Berkey because Raymond showed that he cannot be trusted because he made a terrible mistake even though it's only one mistake actually no he's made a couple mistakes so we're gonna use player developments actually no I'll wait till the next episode to do the player development so thank you guys for watching I really appreciate it if you did like this video click the like button and if you love me and want to see more of this then subscribe and i'll see you guys next time peace